Coming up next, on Channel 7 News at noon, the standoff continues in Panama, but there are signs it may end soon. We'll have the latest on Manuel Noriega's struggle to stay free. There were some tense moments today on the 747 that took off from Miami. We'll let you know what happened. The cold weather may be over, but we've just begun to pay the price. We'll tell you how the cold spell could affect the prices you pay in the grocery store. And it's almost Orange Bowl time. Today we'll take a sneak peek at some of the floats you'll see on Parade Day. These stories plus lots more. Coming up next on Channel 7 News at noon. Here's a tasty way to go from year to Happy New Year with a little help from the Honey Baked Store. Begin your celebration with a variety of our delicious hot and cold hors d'oeuvres. Then ring in the new year with a classic tip. Make it honey baked for the best of times. You've seen it before, but you've never seen it like this. Now America's best known judge, Judge Wapner and the People's Court are traveling to courthouses throughout the country, bringing you new faces, new places, and fun new cases. The People's Court, on the road across America. The People's Court, weekdays at 4.30 on WSBN 7. Live from Channel 7, South Florida's news station, Joe Lovett, Jane Avery, and weather with Tom Burks. This is Channel 7 News at Noon. Is the stalemate over what to do with Manuel Noriega finally coming to an end? Good afternoon, Joan and Jane are working the night shift. I'm Darren Black. And I'm Charles Molino. Our top story, the Bush administration is turning up the pressure on the Vatican Embassy this afternoon to turn over General Noriega to the U.S. U.S. troops are still standing guard outside the embassy, but Vatican officials in Rome say international law and diplomatic procedure will not allow Noriega to be extradited to Miami. Before beginning a Texas vacation today, President Bush told reporters he's still trying to get Noriega out of the embassy. Thank you.